Hello, beautiful soul. Welcome to the Unconditional Self Love <sighs> online course. I am so excited for you. I am Melanie of Mella Minds, and I am a life mindset productivity embodiment coach. Okay. We embody the mindset we intend to step into to get us through our wonderful lives. We embody the life that we intend and that we design. And then we embody the productivity of, and it's in no order, but the productivity, the actions that are going to lead us to our higher selves. We really get down into that and just sprout outwards with all of the plan and action through the embodiment. So welcome. I also do astrology natal chart readings as well as human design. So welcome here. I am so excited that you are here because I have, I've completed the beginning of the unconditional self love online course. And what I'm doing is I am offering it for free um, for the first module, and I'm so excited that you are here. So with that, we are going to just do a little rundown of how the weeks going forward are going to be, because after the free one, you're definitely obviously going to continue in the the deriving modules, at least that you are going to be putting forth in your life. And so that's the self-recognition, self-judgment, self-worth, and self-confidence. You're going to feel just grounded in the very things that are holding you back, the self-judgments that are holding you back, where you don't feel the worth possibly, and also where you lack the confidence. What's, what is keeping you from that confident self, okay? And I also teach confidence classes in Orange County, so look out for those dates. So, Moving on, we do end up going to the action. Yes, the productivity action stages, um, chapters. And those chapters are about initiating that very action that it is that you need to go forward. And so that's going to be the self-discipline. That's going to be the self-boundaries, how to create boundaries and how important it is to know what you're going to allow in your life and what you are saying absolutely not to. Next is self-righteousness. How do you show up in your community? What do you stand for? What are you going to allow to happen around you? And how can you be a, excuse me, a standard of, of how to present oneself and to the community? Like you have to be an example. And the question of self-righteousness is what do you stand for? Okay. And then we have self-trust. What foundation do you trust within yourself? Self-trust is going to be just so, so important. The three, the three within that, the um, power integration modules is self-discipline, self-boundaries, and self-righteousness, okay? And then we move on to the unconditional love modules. Now, I do have an option where you guys can get coaching within the unconditional love modules um, because now you're, you're headed towards graduation. I mean, you guys can have coaching all throughout, but there's actually a package for this level when you get to the level of... Um, when once you've graduated from the other modules, we'll say it like that. And so the unconditional love modules are that of pure embodiment of truly loving every aspect of yourself. And those make up self-trust, self-acceptance, and unconditional self-love. That is you graduating from the unconditional self-love online course, and you will be, I mean, you're already a goddess. You're already a god, a queen, a king. Everything that you are, you already are that. It's just at the end of this course, you're going to be sitting there with this kind of invisible crown and you're like, my eyes are open. I am aware now. I am awake now to my power. And nothing's going to stop me, not even myself, okay? That's your power, is awareness, so I'm super excited for you. 
uh, the rundown of how we are going to do this, you're just going to go through a module right at the beginning of the week, and you're going to have your journal ready, you're going to have some pens ready, and you're going to have your worksheets downloaded that you are ready to go, and you are just going to make sure that you're in a mindset to truly, truly derive those things out of your psyche that you are ready to let go. And when I say let go, I mean, when there's a question that comes up, and your brain is like, oh, I don't want to answer that. Or, oh, this that's too hard. Sit with it. Answer it. Also, throughout this course, please have grace for yourself. Show up with grace and say, you know, I'm going to do my best. And my best is going to be what it is. I will not pressure myself. I will not force myself upon anything. Again, your human design uh, profile will be so important to know about so that you know about your energy expenditure. If you are a projector or a manifester and you know or a reflector and you know that this it's gonna take up a lot of energy to even get it going, plan that accordingly, okay? So the very first day is of maybe like an hour of work, maybe two hours. And then the rest of the week you're gonna be led with a um with the journal prompt, okay? So you're gonna show up every day for yourself, bring your journal and write down the answer to your journal prompts, okay? You are powerful and you are so ready to do this. And it's one of those things, don't try to get in front of it, okay? Don't try to get in front of it and say, oh, this isn't gonna work anyway, or, oh, I get the gist of journaling, I get it. Actually do it, do it and see how it will change your life. Plug in. Just go ahead and really, really commit to this. Commit to this for yourself. At the end of these 10 day of these 10 weeks, you can truly grow yourself to an amount that you never thought you could. And I'm so happy to be able to help you guide yourself to that. Uh, but truly, truly do the work. Do it all. Do the worksheets. Do the journal prompts. Do the mindfulness sessions. Each section has a mindfulness section where we close our eyes and envision who we are meeting, who we are meeting as in ourself, our higher selves, our past selves, and all of the people um, that we are bringing into our lives. How are you showing up? And so bring in your mindfulness time. A lot of times people, like a lot of times we are just a mindfulness session away from initiating something great. But what happens is I have an idea. That was an idea. I had an idea. And then it's gone. Okay, what we do at Melamind is we make sure that we have an idea and then we're writing it down and then we're revisiting it and then we're having mindfulness time. We are sitting down and itemizing the actions that it takes to make that thing happen. And then we sit with ourselves and we say, well, do I have the capacity, the need, the will, the resources to do those itemized tasks? If it's a yes, oh my goodness, you are so close to what it is that you want. If it's a no, you know exactly what you need to work towards in order to get what you want, right? Check out the habit tracking online course. You might find that it too changes your life. You are going to have the habit, task, and actions that are going to lead you to your higher self and a tracking system, an embodiment system, a place where you are able to actually breathe life into the actions that you are intending to implement in your daily life in order to get to your highest self. It's all right there. So definitely explore that. Um, other than that, just again, bring grace for yourself and participate. Have so much fun. Love yourself. And oh my gosh, I can't wait. I can't wait to hear about how it's going to go for you and how it's going for you. And thank you so much for trusting me with your energy and your light and have the most amazing day. Enjoy module one. Enjoy recognizing yourself, pulling in that recognition, because once you know, once you're aware, then you have a choice. Do I want to change this? And how do I change this? If it's a no, I don't want to change this. Don't change. You don't need to change. Everything is not a call to action. It's literally we're just labeling things, okay? We're just labeling. It doesn't mean change me. 
change, change. No, no, no. We are not changing you. We are labeling and finding points where you do want to take action, finding points where you want to ascribe awareness, and finding points that you are just saying it is what it is, okay? Ah, it's going to be so powerful, and I'm so excited for you. And yes, sending big hugs and lights and sunshine to you all. <laughs> Okay, have an amazing day. And I'm Melanie of Melamine. Definitely contact me if you need anything. <laughs>